since let me use this opportunity to talk to you this week i saw in whatsapp a funny prophecy from a nigerian fellow that calls himself that says some is a he said he's a prophet from edo state which i doubt and this young man was giving fearful prophecies in our country talking about war and destruction it will start in the city and it will come from up country i mean dangerous dangerous so-called prophecy that kind of prophecy does not give faith what it see prophecy should i defy but this prophecy does not give faith what does it give fear and do you know what if we begin to fear because of those evil prophecy our fear will bring the things to pass our fear will bring the evil pronouncements to pass so we as children of god should understand what brings fear and fear has the capacity to, to manufacture to fabricate to create and bring it to pass so this like the evil prophecy this guy has given if you begin to pass around because some of you some of you that's my fear some of you will be passing hey have you heard have you heard they said what war, war is coming they said there will be bloodshed and stop saying these things and don't go to god with some fear go to god in faith listen to me hear what this guy said he said he asked god if people are not praying he said god said all of us in saloon we are praying with our our lips but our hearts are not with god can you imagine that can you imagine that what we know there are faithful men and women that are praying and calling upon the name of the lord in fact wherever you are i want you to join me i want us to pray one or two cancellation prayers i want you to repeat after me these words and let us pray the prayer any any evil prophecy that they have given let's let's cancel it are you ready say it with me in the name of jesus every negative prophecy every negative proclamation every negative declaration every negative announcement concerning our country Sierra Leone be cancelled and be terminated by fire in the name of Jesus be cancelled be terminated by fire in Jesus name say in the name of Jesus my father every evil pronouncement of war bloodshed confusion we cancel we nullify we neutralize and we declare that it shall not stand neither shall it come to pass in the name of jesus in the name of jesus it shall not stand it shall not stand bloodshed shall not come to pass war shall not come to pass confusion shall not come to pass it shall not stand neither shall it come to pass in the mighty name of jesus continue with me say father by the authority of hebrews 12 24 we invoke the speakings of the blood of jesus to speak over our beloved nation sierra leone blood of jesus speak better things over sierra leone speak mercy speak peace speak development in the name of Jesus, blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus, blood of Jesus, we release your better words over this nation. Speak mercy, speak grace, speak salvation, speak deliverance. Blood of Jesus, we release your words to take over, over this nation of Sierra Leone and over our lives individually and collectively in Jesus' mighty name. Finally, I want to so pray this prayer. Say, my father, my father anyone, anyone that the devil wants to use to bring Sierra Leone into war, into confusion, into bloodshed, into destruction, oh Lord, visit them with judgment of thunder and fire. Oh Lord, visit them with judgment of thunder and fire. Take one minute and you pray that prayer. Yes, let God visit them with thunder and fire. Anyone that Satan wants to use to bring confusion, to bring bloodshed, to bring destruction in our country, may the judgment of God fire them with thunder. Judgment of God 
Fire them with thunder. Lord, visit them with judgment of thunder and fire in the name of Jesus. We destroy their works. We destroy their plans. We terminate the operation. We cancel their activities. It shall not stand. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Second Timothy chapter 1 verse 7. He said, For God has not given us the spirit of fear, but of power and of love and of sound man. Saints of God, this morning, I encourage you, fear not. During this time of crisis, like what we have now, fear not. If you live your life in fear, you will not see the mighty hand of God. The corona you see today, the Lord will drown it in his Red Sea. I say the corona you see today, the Lord will drown it in his Red Sea. I said I the corona you see today, the Lord will drown it in his Red Sea. In Jesus' mighty name. Now I want you to put your hands on your body. I want to pray for you quickly. Anywhere of your body that you are sick, just put your hands there. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I raise my voice up to heaven and I pray for everyone under the sound of my voice, whether they are sick emotionally, physically, or whether they are going through any economic issue, financial problems, whether they have issues, professional issues, whatever it is, my father, domestic issues, I take authority and dominion, I cancel, I terminate, I nullify, I neutralize in the name of Jesus. I release healing, I release deliverance, I release restoration in the name of Jesus. Lord, before this week runs out, show your mighty hand in the name of Jesus. Visit your people, bless their life, turn their situation around. Amen. Grant them testimonies Amen. that your name shall be exalted. Amen. I thank you because it is settled and it is done. Amen. In Jesus' name and somebody shout a mighty Amen. Amen.